A sign on U.S. Highway 54 between Las Cruces and Alamogordo points the way to the High Energy Laser Systems Test Facility, but the public isn't granted access to the area on White Sands Missile Range. Commonly known as Hellstaff, the test facility operates the nation's most powerful laser in support of Department of Defense Laser Research, according to the website wsmr.army.mil. Since 1981, the nation has invested millions of dollars into high-energy laser research conducted at White Sands. Hellstaff is isolated on the tightly controlled Army base on a government range where high-technology infrastructure is already in place. White Sands, in conjunction with Holloman Air Force Base in Alamogordo and Fort Bliss, which, while headquartered in El Paso, Texas, has most of its land in Otero County, New Mexico, is the largest contiguous landmass in the DOD's inventory. New laser technologies such as free electron or advanced solid-state lasers are studied at Hellstaff, according to the website. Among the capabilities, the mid-infrared advanced chemical laser was built for the Navy and proved chemical laser technology can be scaled to multi-megawatt power levels. The Sea Light Beam Director is a system Hughes aircraft constructed for the U.S. Navy and can track and destroy highly maneuverable tactical targets. The infrared optics also serve as a high-resolution infrared imaging system that can record missile test data. The Pulse Laser Vulnerability Test System is a surrogate laser device capable of duplicating many tactical laser threat systems. Areas for testing include the effects test area, an indoor controlled laboratory test environment, as well as the large vacuum chamber, which can produce a vacuum equivalent to a 600,000 foot altitude and is the only large vacuum chamber in the country capable of allowing the entry of full power high energy laser beams. Hellstaff is number 43 on the New Mexico Space Trail.